ain't exactly logical, though, is it? Lola would be ashamed. No, she wouldn't. Of course she wouldn't. She knew what desperate felt like. I think what she'd do is she'd hold your hand, tell you that everything's going to be all right. You know, you're allowed to have bad days. But she would tell you that she loves you for who you are. And she would tell you that she needs you to look after our little girl, would she not? Hey, because we both know that she thought I was a liability on my own. And she'd call you a plank, probably, for not realising it, but she'd want you to know just how important you are. How much everyone loves you. How many people care about you? How precious your life is, mate. I, don't know, I think she'd actually say, I think she'd... I think she'd say that guts come from carrying on. Like she did. She'd want you to live your life to the full. We all want you to live your life to the full, all of us. One day at a time, one step at a time. That's what she'd say. Hey, it can't be this dark forever, right? And hey, listen, we can, I don't know, next year or the year after, we could do that thing that Lola always promised Lex, you know, have that big Halloween party. We can dress up, me and you. Zombies and ghosts compete for who can embarrass Lex the most. <laughs> we can plan things. Have things to look forward to, you know. Me and you, bro. <clears throat> From now on, you ain't on your own. <laughs> 